Smash that like button for me. Well, we got Dr. Dre getting called out for being a clout chaser. We got YG remembering Nipsey Hussle. And then we also got Magic, Magic Johnson, revealing why he left the Lakers. Let's get right into it. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you hit that like button. Please hit that like button. I love you guys so much. Make sure you hit that subscribe and the bell. I hope you guys had a great Monday. It's over. Now we're going to tackle Tuesday tomorrow. You guys got it. You guys got the power. You guys can do it. Just keep going forward. You can't, if, as long as you keep going forward, nobody can stop. You got to stay in motion. Okay, let's get right into it. Okay, so uh, Dr. Dre, he's posting up photos of like paintings and Nipsey and stuff on his Instagram. Dr. Dre, Nipsey Hustle in the game. Now, they, you know... The game came over and then they had this like portrait and Dr. Dre took pictures next to it. Well, this rubbed people the wrong way because they said, I don't care how nobody feels about this. Dr. Dre should not be near any Nipsey tribute or anything related to Nip because he didn't support him while he was here and he shouldn't be getting any clout off his death. I don't care. Then other people says Nips wanted to work with him so badly. He said it so many times. It was one of his dreams and he constantly ignored him. Uh, someone else said, uh, da, 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 da. well, and that's the same thing. Someone said, Compton Menace also spoke on this. Oh, God, he did? Uh, okay, he said, I know they never collaborated, but there is more to this? Uh, some people, someone else said, a lot of you think I'm saying he can't get new fans or that Dr. Dre shouldn't support or not. Nah, I'm saying, how is ridiculous is the, the, the legendary gatekeeper in the game, avoided, ignored, and passed on a huge movement in his city for 12 years. Was it for 12 years? I would say I would give it more like 10 years, but yeah. Only time. Dre give dude love in his death? And some other people said, uh, and how would, how would you know that he didn't support him because it wasn't on IG, Twitter or IG? You're really simple-minded. And, you know, the fight goes on. I don't know. I mean, he's just paying respects. The guy's dead, you know. Yeah, Nipsey was a great person, and he passed. You know, it affected everybody. Yeah, he probably he probably regrets not working with him. I'll tell you that much. Magic Johnson reveals he was betrayed by the uh, Lakers GM Rob Pel- Pelinka. He said when he took the job, he answered to some woman. I forget her name. So Magic Johnson said. I'm not going to stop my other businesses, uh, but I, I will take on the role as president and I'll stay for three years, right? Well, as time went on, GM Rob Palenka would talk crap about Mag Johnson saying, oh, he's not in the office that much, uh, you know. Then, you know, he didn't think anything of it until it got cut outside the office. And Magic Johnson said his own friends outside the office were telling him that this guy Rob was saying that kind of stuff. Then it came up to fire the, uh, the current... Um, coach, right? Or the coach at the time. And Magic Johnson said, you know, he usually just answers to this woman, right? But now he has to bring this person and that person in, so he lost any power. Like, he was supposed to have a certain amount of power being the president and that power wasn't there. So he said, you know what? I don't really want to deal with this. It's not fun anymore. You know, the people are talking crap about me and this. So he kind of just bowed out, as I would too. If I was Magic Johnson, I had so much other stuff going on. I mean, this guy has a lot of businesses, a lot. This was like for fun. And you know, if it's not fun, why do it? You know, it's like life's too short, man. So he felt backstabbed, but that this guy Rob Palenka was targeting for his job. When he was really saying, he told the guy Rob that I'm just getting you ready for my job. I'm out of here in a few years. And I don't know. YG shares a throwback photo of uh, him and uh, Russell Westbrook and Nip. And he says, going to miss you, bro. The marathon continues. I want to congratulate Nipsey for his legacy and everything he did. All the game he gave me, all the people he touched, and the brand he left behind. On behalf of the West Coast, on behalf of LA Streets, we love you. We're going to miss you. You already know what it is. Rest in power, Nipsey. Rest in peace, Nipsey, man. Yeah, man, that's uh, that's it for the news so far. We'll get some more. Uh, I do have more news. I meant to do another story, but we'll do this one for now. Stuart Taylor with JT News. Hit that bell. Hit the subscribe button. Make sure you go to Equifax, TransUnion, and Experian.com. It's all free to go challenge things on your credit to get them off to raise your credit score. That's very important. And don't forget, guys, get enough sleep tonight. 
take on Tuesday. Make Tuesday your bitch. Okay, I love you guys, and I'll check you on the next one. And hit that like button for good vibes. Peace.